Okay, I got a book here. Um, we're going to be learning. I use these gatherings to launch things. In my clinic, I had about 600 herbal medicines that I made for my patients. We sell about 30 or 40 of those and manufacture those for people all over the world. So I'm always releasing uh, original clinical formulas and sometimes new versions of those. And today I'm going to launch uh, a new product called Super Slim. And I'm going to explain that in detail for all of you. See all these big boards up here. You're going to really know something different when you leave. Okay. On our planet, there's a billion fat people. Wow. <laughs> Think about that. It's a wonder we're not off our axis, like flying off into another galaxy. But I don't really care. I mean, okay, over 66%. Over two-thirds of Americans are considered overweight, and over 33%, over a third, are considered obese. Yeah, you know, I, I love leaving others to their otherness. I don't have any stuff about that. Um, Americans spend more money on fast food than on automobiles. Wow, that was amazing when I saw that. But again, you know, who really cares about this stuff? Um, I think everybody should have the right to do whatever they want to do in life as long as they're not hurting somebody else. But let's look at a couple other fat things. Over 70% of the time you go to a medical doctor, it's because of your fat that's caused you to be ill. Wow. Think about that one. Obesity has the same effect on causing disease and making you sick as being 20 years older than you currently are. Uh-oh. Okay, now we're starting to mess with my game. Okay, because my game, remember, is to feel great and have as long of life as possible. And all of a sudden, you're messing with my game now because we're aging 20 years physiologically by carrying all this weight around. If you're in your 50s and you're even a little bit overweight, your chances of dying in the next 10 years are increased 20 to 40 percent than if you weren't overweight at all. That's really messing with the other part of my game, which is living as long as possible. Whew. Fat and heart disease, it's shocking. Over 70% of cardiovascular disease is directly related to obesity. Wow. And think of it, the number one cause of death in America, heart attacks and stroke, cardiovascular disease, high mark. Um, being just, over, just being five pounds overweight pumps up your blood pressure, your cholesterol, increases your chances. I got lots of stats on heart disease. Millions and millions of people dying from cancer. The cancer is caused by them being obese. Over 50% of breast cancer is diagnosed with obese women. 50% of colon cancer, obese people. 14 different major cancers, the number two cause of death, are directly related to being overweight. That's messing with my game big time, because cancer isn't fun, okay? And fun is a big part of my game. Being five pounds overweight increases your risk of type 2 diabetes. And you can reduce your risk of developing diabetes by 60% by just losing 10 pounds and exercising, whoa, two hours a week. So let's go back to the beginning. Obesity has the same effect as aging 20 years. That's messing with my game because I'm not feeling great. I don't have the energy. I, I don't have the passion. I don't have the clear mind. I'm not having the fun and the bliss. And my life is going to be cut short. The two greatest ways to screw up 
my game, which is live long and prosper. And in case none of that affected you, men, obesity means you're not going to get a hard on. Okay, now I have your attention probably. And women, it's going to mean you have, you know, a fat ass, <laughs> thighs, <laughs> belly. Because, um, you know, I'm trying to sell my game here, guys. Uh, that's, that's the name of the game, too.